Good afternoon, Steel Hill, Amy Zion Church family. I would just like to give a shout out to all of our mothers on this Mother's Day. Moms, we honor you today. We honor your hard work, your, your unconditional love, your sacrifice, and your undying devotion to your children. Moms of all ages, we salute you. A word of grace to those of you whose mothers are no longer around, whether it's through death or some other reason. Mother's Day is not always a pleasant experience for everyone, but those who have recently lost a mother, this can be one of those tough days. The grief can feel fresh all over again. To you, I say, our God is a God of comfort. We honor you because you deserve it. May our words, our gifts, and actions flow from a genuine attitude of gratitude, respect, and appreciation. Again, I say to you, Happy Mother's Day to all. Dear Mother in Heaven, I just want you to know how much I miss you every day and how much I love you so. I cannot send you a card, but I can send my love upon the wings of angels to heaven up above. I wish you Happy Mother's Day, for you were the best. To have you for my mother, I knew I had been blessed. Rest in peace, my angel. One day we will be together. The next time that I see you, I know it will be forever. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. I appreciate you for taking me to my baseball games, putting up with all the stuff I do, and even helping with me with my schoolwork. This is for Matthew and Joshua Barr and the rest of the Barr family. Aye. If love is as sweet as a flower, then my mother is the sweet flower of love. A quote from Stevie Wonder. Mom, mom is such a special word, the lovest I've ever heard. A toast to you above all the rest. Mom, you are so special. You are simply the best. Happy Mother's Day. 2020. Hey everybody, it's Kisa just wanting to send Mother's Day wishes to my mother, Doris McElwain, my mother-in-law, Susie Barr, my grandmothers-in-law, and then, of course, last but not least, all of my Still Hill women, mothers, aunties, and cousins who are like mothers. Happy Mother's Day. Hi, happy Mother's Day. No one can match the gentle and loving touch of my mother, Mrs. Vera Mobley Witherspoon. Happy Mother's Day, Steve. One of my mom's biggest lessons was to keep my head up all the time, and that was something that I've always listened to. I was going through a really rough time. I was getting bullied a lot, and she told me that just to keep my head up and not to listen to anybody. She, always, she also said that people have talked about God, so you should just ignore it because God ignored it, but God grew bigger. So what you should do is grow bigger, but don't grow stronger to the point where you hurt them as well as bad as they hurt you with words. She said, it's better to be, you can be the bigger person and just walk away. 
that's all you have to do you don't have to say anything else you could just walk away and that's what I did I took that really into heart at that time and I stopped caring about what people said and I just I was bigger I was a bigger person and I just walked away I said there's no point in me saying anything when I have nothing to say because I don't care so I took I, I took her advice and I bit I did the bigger I was a bigger person and I left um one of my favorite one of my favorite um verses is ooh, Proverbs 31 and 17 she dresses herself with strength she dresses herself with strength that and strengthen her arms yeah that's how it goes so and I also want to say that my grandma has my grandmother Margaret McElwain is a very wonderful woman too she has taught me a lot of things she also taught me how to just be very independent for myself she's taught me how to grow to an under understanding to certain what certain people say um my grandma has taught me a lot of verses in life for the last 13 years um i know one of them was isaiah 53 verse 5 with his stripes we are healed um, she has said multiple things to me, and I just really wanted to say Happy Mother's Day. So, Happy Mother's Day, Grandma and Mom. Bye. Happy Mother's Day, Marla. I love you so very much, and I just wanted to give you a shout out to say that I love you and to thank you so much for everything that you've done in my life, all of the things that you've poured into me to make me be the woman that I am today. Thank you so much for your gentleness. Thank you for teaching me how to cook and teaching me how to work hard and to be respectful and to be a good wife and to be, most of all, a great woman of God. I appreciate you so much and if I don't say it enough I love you I love you I love you and I pray for God's best and I want you to enjoy every day of your life and you know that I'm with you all the way and anything that you ever need you always can call on me um, because I am that girl remember those farm years remember those times that we stuck together cooked together and and I appreciate everything and you are far above rubies you are amazing and again, I love you so much. Happy Mother's Day.